Hello there everybody, I'm back with another very exciting After Effects story video On today's tutorial, I'm gonna show you how to make this uh, very cool and exciting loading dots It's uh, pretty easy, so let's uh, begin Grab the ellipse tool and draw a perfect circle, just hold on shift while you're drawing it Okay, now uh, get the align tool, to get that just go to window and make sure you are uh, uh, check in this box here just uh, to align the uh, shape perfectly on the center okay just select the uh, shape uh, pick the pin behind tool and just adjust the anchor point on the middle open up the transforms options and drag this below like that Okay, now let's remove this shock when I'm gonna be using it. Okay, now let's start the animation. Just go to rotation, set this uh, parameter here to 180. Enable the uh, stopwatch here. Go few frames forward. Turn this to 360. And then turn turn it back to 180. Okay, so we've created uh, this very dull and interesting animation. Let's make it more functioning. So uh, let's uh, enable the uh, graph view. To do that, just press on this icon here. Uh, with the uh, rotation parameter selected drag this keyframe down create a nice curve okay, like that then drag this one also to zero try to uh, simulate the same curve on the other side select this both uh, keyframes here and uh, convert them to auto bezier let's uh, play the animation now Okay, looks uh, more interesting. Okay, now let's uh, just duplicate this multiple times. I'm gonna duplicate it four times. And let's, uh, let's specify for each shape the moment uh, it's gonna appear. So I'm gonna hit page down a few times to uh, go from frame to frame so just just hit page down one two three four five okay and then drag this uh, on the timeline and snip it exactly on the uh, marker here on the timeline to do that just hit shift and it's gonna be snipped go four frames forward one two three four five snip that out then 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 Snap that one Let's uh, play the animation now Okay, that looks better Okay, now we're gonna make things more interesting So let's change the colors Like, I'm gonna Change this to a soft red color. Okay, just like that. Okay, uh, now we're at the final step, so uh, let's create an adjustment layer go to effects and presets and type in fast blur apply it to adjustment layer so for, for those who don't know what the adjustment layer does it's uh, uh, you apply effect to it and every uh, layer below it will be affected uh, by the same effect so uh, Let's also grab a matte choker 
uh, put it below the fast blow this is very critical okay now I'm gonna put the blowiness to 2.5 or 3 and drag the uh, gray level softness down just a few few grades let's replay the animation and see the difference now as you can see there's this very awesome liquid in animation going on like there are pieces of I don't know weird liquid maybe you can see this uh, you can see this uh, morphing effects between two, uh, the both layers, like like each one is being dragged out of the other. It's really cool. Yeah, let's uh, replay this once again. You can always uh, adjust the offsets of the uh, layer. Just drag this here let's see what we've got now okay that was uh, pretty much it you can always add some motion blur just check these boxes here and enable the motion blur from here and you should be done yeah you can uh, stylize the color the uh, speed anything else it's just up to you so I just uh, choose this different color it can be uh, anything li like uh, a gradient color or maybe just one uniform color just the uh, color options it's just all up to you and all up to your imagination so yeah this was it for today's video hope you guys enjoyed please if you did so press the like button if you wish to see more of these uh, similar tutorial videos subscribe and uh, support us and uh, thanks for watching